Hi guys, Team Muzart here. More than just a pen. Today's video, we're going to be drawing Kevin Hart. Why? Because I need to be doing a skin tone tutorial series, so I chose Kevin Hart because he is a dark brother, and so am I, but we embrace it, you know what I'm saying? Um, but yesterday I was reading through the comments as well, and someone says, I prefer your realistic drawings, and I thought to myself, you know what, that person has a point. Um, it's all about balance, um, and I try to make everybody happy on my channel, although, yeah, it's, it's a difficult task, you know what I mean? You can't make everyone happy, but you try your best and that's what I'm trying to do um, also working a full-time job um, and trying to balance creating videos every day it's a difficult task not making any excuses I decided to do this so I'm doing it um, but yeah it is challenging and yeah this is a part of my tutorial series for patreon um, the tutorial video will be out soon again all the work I gotta do but yeah, I will find time in order to do the voiceovers and everything and get these tutorials out there to my patrons. Um, again, my patrons, if you're watching this, you're the real MVP. You're trying to make this a full-time job for me. Hey, you see that rhyme? You are the real MVP. You're trying to make this a real job for me. Hey, I might become a rapper, you know? Anyways, <laughs> yeah, I just want to say a huge thank you to my patrons for supporting me financially as well, which is great. Um, all 11 of you. Real G's. Anyways, today's video, skin tone, dark skin tone, something that's been requested by Demus for a long time now, and I'm going to make it happen. We're going to do that guy, the comedian, the guy that's just funny and over the top funny, um, but I still like him. He's a cool dude. Kevin Hart, kind hearted. And yeah, let's just, just go do this Kevin Hart drawing. I'm lying to you guys. I've already done it. I was up all night because this guy was supposed to come at my house 7 in the morning and start doing our floor because our floor makes a lot of noise kick, 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 kick. and I was like there's no way I'll go work at 7 today so I was like I'm not waking up with this guy making noise and I can't record my video and all that stuff so I'm gonna stay up all night I stayed up until 5 in the morning because I love you guys and I'll, I'll go get that content out you know what I mean so at 5 in the morning and right now it's 11 o'clock um, so I ain't slept much, <laughs> but I run better on five, six hours of sleep. That's just how I am. I'm just weird like that. Anyways, so I've already done the drawing, but now I'm going to show you guys the process of the drawing um, with a nice voiceover um, explaining what I'm doing and all that stuff. Obviously, you guys know the full length one will be on Patreon soon. So if you want to go join my Patreon, so support your boy and learn at the same time, uh, you can head over there. The link is in the description. That would be amazing to have you come join us. And yeah, man, let's go get into this. Try to give you guys some help. And hopefully you guys do find this video helpful. There will be other skin tones as well that I'll be trying. So if you guys have any suggestions on subjects for me to use in order to create these tutorial skin to real, to real skin tone tutorial videos, then please comment that below and I will try and look up them subjects and stuff and get these videos done for you. Uh daily drawing is going well. I'm actually enjoying this. I'm not tired, I'm not drained or anything like that uh, which most people thought I would be within like the first week um, but yeah time management I'm getting better at it so I'm not really yeah I'm not really faced by these daily drawings anyways um, but yeah let's go get into this video this uh, skin tone Kevin Hart tutorial video I don't even know what to call it <laughs> but anyways, let's go get into this and yeah enjoy the video guys enjoy the video so for this video we will be using our Stedler pens and we will also be using that black soft bic um, which is incredible I love these pens both brands um, work incredibly soft and they're just good pens in general so because we're doing a dark skin tone these are the only colors we'll be needing we'll be needing orange uh, brown and black uh, we won't be using any pink or yellow but that it also depends on the subject and the lighting um, with this drawings particularly um, there's not really much any like real sunlight in his face and everything it looks like the picture's been taken in a studio so you don't really get that natural sunlight um, on his face but there are areas that are left out white um, simply because of the whole light hitting his face and everything but yeah with this tutorial basically what I'm going to be showing you guys is the ability to create different tones 
using these two colors um well let's say three colors if you include the black but the two colors orange and brown by creating multiple layers overlapping it as you can see i've got that scrap piece of paper on the side which is my palette is where i go to get my ink started where i go to mess around and try and get different tones but with a drawing like this you have to build it up with multiple multiple layers it's going to take a lot of patience which is what book point pen requires because your drawing is is being made up by creating lines so the first thing i did was basically use the brown obviously the first couple of layers um, because i didn't feel like them it's the left hand side needed any orange at that time um, again like i always say to you guys you have to analyze your reference photo look at it as much as you can in order to get drawing as realistic as possible so i've only used a little bit of orange because i don't feel like i need it that much in these areas and i'm using the brown mainly because he is he's a dark person he's pretty dark um but yeah with this you're gonna have to focus on leaving the white areas in order to create that realistic factor like i've done here with the nose area and side of the cheek uh, you can use a little bit of orange there here and there but try and use the brown mainly when you're drawing something that's really dark um i've used also a little bit of black on the side of the face um like i've said multiple times as well black is a color you want to be careful with because it's dangerous you apply it too much it's just going to look black and yeah we're not trying to do that so be careful with the black and how much you use it but you have to overlap create layers it's the best way to go about it and it's going to take you time with this drawing i could have spent to be honest another three four hours on it um easily by just creating more layers and just making it more and more and more realistic with the time you spend on it um again this tutorial is not really about hair it's about how to create dark skin tones so the hair part i'm, I'm gonna skip it we're not gonna really focus on that so yeah create your layers take your time and as you can see, I'm doing it a stroke at a time because your drawing is made up of lines. That's ballpoint pen. You make lines in order to create a drawing. And it takes time, a lot of work, but it's not something you can't do. You just have to be patient and make sure all your strokes are consistent in order to create that balanced that we need. We need that balance and your lines need to be as close together as possible because we don't want any separate lines in within the drawing we want everything to look connected everything to look as one and the best way to do that is by having that consistent pressure and creating multiple layers in order to create that illusion of realism and um, when you go up close to the drawing that's when you really see the beauty of it you can really see the lines the depth of the lines and see all the layers um but when it's like this video you can't really see because the camera can't pick it up but when you go up close to your drawing it is built up with multiple multiple layers as you can see with me i'm just doing a lot of back and forth back and forth back and forth and yeah a lot of cross hatching again i add a little bit of scribbling here and there um but that's just part of my technique i do cross hatching and i do a little bit of scribbling but i also make some when i'm doing scribbling it's still consistent i still try and keep the same amount of pressure and the way i like to go about doing things like this is i apply everything lightly first and then build on top of that i don't apply anything dark straight away that's why my pens last a long time because i create them layers instead of just pressing with the black card one time and then using a lot of ink that i don't really need to um, i used a little bit of pink for the lips which you guys just saw there um so i guess that's another color i used did i really need to use it no nah, i could have done with just the brown and the uh, orange if i really wanted to but i saw pink in the reference photo so i decided to bring in the pink the pink is rhyming station by the way for if any if, if any of you want to know um this is the non-branded tesco <laughs> blue pen that i'm using here to do the suit um again this tutorial is about the face and how to create the dark skin tone but yeah the keys to remember are of course create your layers and make sure your pressure is consistent and look out for highlights highlights is a problem when it comes to dark skin tone because i could have done kevin hart's face all blacked out just you know what i mean all like brown but that's not realistic you always have some kind of light source coming from some area and 
it also depends if he was in like a dark room then his face i'll have to probably use a bit more brown and a bit more black as well in order to create the shadows and stuff like that just like a little bit what i did with the left hand side i used a bit of black there um again if you guys would like to see me do another subject like a dark skin tone subject but in like a darker situation um then yeah i'll try and get that done for you guys but i hope you guys have picked up anything from this again like i said in the beginning of this video the real time full time one with voice over um, follow me along and um, it's going to be available on patreon soon for you guys to watch but yeah pressure layering consistent strokes using your highlights and your you could create them dark values as well and yeah man that is basically it for this tutorial video i hope you guys have found it helpful um as you can see those there's all there are all the colors that i used in this video and i will see you lot in the next one bye guys So that is it for my video today. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. Like I said in the beginning, the full length version will be on Patreon soon. So make sure to go join us at the gang gang, gang gang on Patreon. And yeah, there's plenty of tutorials already on there for you guys. So you can guys get a beginning step into the bullpen pen world, layering pressure, or um, how to draw with black pen, skin tone ones as well on there. And just overall, I had construction construction lines, create construction lines. Um, just play the tutorials on there, and yeah, hopefully you guys will enjoy them. Anyways, make sure to comment, share, share, subscribe to Demon's Art. That's me. All the tools and everything I use in this video, linked in the description. And yeah, I'm out. See you guys tomorrow. Peace.